If you're like one of millions of smartphone owners all over the world, you're probably addicted to TikTok. The video sharing app has taken the world by storm, fueled by their merger with Musical.ly in 2018 and a void in the market created by the death of Vine. TikTok is still young enough that, with some luck and a bit of talent, anyone can go viral. If you're looking to take your videos to the next level, it's time to learn how to use TikTok's slow motion effect. Compared to apps like Snapchat or Instagram, TikTok's video capture tool is actually surprisingly powerful. You won't have to press and hold your finger on the capture button to keep rolling, and you won't have to wait until you've captured your clip to add effects, cut between shots, and change the lighting of your scene. Open TikTok's viewfinder in the app, then look for the recording options along the right side of the screen. In this menu, you'll find an icon that appears to look like a speedometer, labeled speed. Tap on this icon and you'll see the speed option change from off to on. Right above the capture button, you'll find a new menu that lets you affect how TikTok captures your video. By default, TikTok's main speed setting is 1x, which records at normal pace. However, by changing your recording speed to 0.5x or 0.3x, you can slow down your recording and add a slow motion effect to your video. Just keep in mind that when you're recording with either of these modes on, your time limit will be reached much faster. Recording at 0.3 times, for example, fills your entire 15 second limit in about 5 seconds. You may want to switch your video recording mode to 60 seconds before turning on slow motion. If you've already recorded your video but you forgot to turn on slow motion before recording, you are not out of luck. Though you won't be given as much control over how slow-mo affects your video, you can still apply a slow motion effect when editing your TikTok. When you're in the edit screen, tap on effects along the bottom toolbar, then tap on time. Along with reverse and repeat tools, you'll find a slow motion filter that lets you apply the effect after you've already finished recording. To adjust when slow motion begins on your clip, just slide the green toolbar along your clip's timeline. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering social media and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.